Well, pretty much every time out in the UFC, DC, this man has put on a striking clinic, and that is his methodology coming in here tonight. He'll try to keep the fight on. And that's why we tune in, right? That's why we tune in. We tune in to see guys that are dynamic. We tune in for the speed. We tune in for the knowledge of the striking game, the ability to set traps, the ability to find the jab, the ability to find the right hand, the right kick, the left kick, the knees, the elbows. He truly uses every weapon that he has in his arsenal to try and finish his opponent. You make one mistake, night's over. You cannot make mistakes against a guy that has the striking acumen yeah. of this guy right here. And the jab is not as underutilized a weapon as it was in MMA, say, five or seven years ago, but he's got as good a jab as anyone in the business, and that is where all of his striking flows off of. We'll see how it goes for him in this matchup tonight. Well, there is no denying this man's striking credentials. Prevailing wisdom is he's going to try to keep this fight standing tonight. He has to. You know, this is what got him to the show. It was being able to use the hands to set up the kicks. We all talk about the high-level boxing background of this young man. But as he's developed, he's developed great knees. Yeah. He's developed great timing, great counter skills, and also the beautiful right high kick. The right high kick is something he eyes very well as he follows with a jab right hand left hook. High kick comes over the top, and he can put you to sleep. No doubt about it. He will try to put on a striking clinic. Ready. All right, so here we go with round one. Classic matchup of striker versus striker. These guys have both faced a lot of grapplers in the past. They like the draw tonight. Oh, yeah, they love seeing an opponent that will not be trying to dive at their legs. They know when they get to the center of the octagon, the only steps back they will take is if they choose to move out of range to re-enter back into the striking realm. It's a very comforting thought for both of these competitors. Fight. Nice job to block the shot there. Well, perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed by this gentleman. All right, he engages in the single collar tie. And there comes the separation now. Big kick lands. He lands a knee there. Nice deception there to get that knee to the target. Really good knee. Nice job of driving right to the target. Get the plan. Exactly where you want it. Big ball punch lands. Now he gets back to range. A oh, little single collar tie there. And he landed the right hand there. Just misses with a left hook there. Good punch. Circling to his right. Just missed with the leg kick. Nice hook. Nice jab. And a knee. Oh! Throwing hard in the pocket. Unable to find the target. Still nice body to land. And they separate. Look at him working at trying to shut the liver down. Until he blocks it, you better keep throwing those body kicks. I mean, he's cutting down the size with these beautiful leg kicks. Oh, and he lands a punch there. Good connection by him. It looked like it did stun him a little bit. What a fantastic strike to throw at the exact right moment. He deserves this moment. Go finish his fight. 
So he's really starting to put together some significant body shots here. These are gonna take their toll as this fight goes on. Big knee to the body! Look at the angle of that nice body kick. Big punch lands over the top. How's he gonna follow this one up? Right punches there. to go here in what has been a competitive and action-packed first round. Oh, a huge block there. Look at how he turns his hip over when he throws that kick. Oh, and he lands another leg kick there. I have a novel idea. Maybe the opponent should try to check one of these. He's got to try to check him, but he can't, John, because there's no wind-up. Yeah. There's no tell. And when he feels his opponent is getting a beat on his leg kicks, he'll just pop a jab up, get the hands up to block the face, blast the leg kick on the bottom. It's unbelievable to watch a guy that is so diverse yeah. and has such a great understanding of landing these leg kicks. Look at the whip action that comes from him throwing that kick. I mean, this guy is really focused on those punches to the head inside of the clinch. Why, so there is the horn at times in that previous round. I didn't think we'd get here after that head kick nearly had him out of there. It was a good round leading up to that. But when you take a head kick like that, when your opponent gets your entire body into that kick, usually the night's over. Very tough to still be standing, but he can't take many more like that. Ready, fight. Ready. Round two is underway. Continuing to work the body to great effect. Whoa! Oh, he's hurt bad. He's hurt bad, John. He's got to press him. He's got to go chase that finish down now. Oh, no! Oh, straight right! Punch coming, it's blocked. He has a commitment to kicking tonight, and it shows. Came of inches right there, boy. Wow. It was a good night if that landed. Big punch land. Ooh. Real quick leg kick. Much improved defensively as he blocks the shot. All right, so he's landed some good shots. You hate to be overly critical, but nothing really in terms of combinations tonight. Well, the jab has been looking great. How about jab, jab, right hand? Because eventually you're going to have to put something on your opponent that's going to really make him pause. I believe the jab has been working so well, if he drops a big right hand after it, he may be able to finish his fight. Look at him whip his hip into that kick. Wow! He needs to start looking to finish now because he's got his opponent hurt very bad. Oh, and he caught the kick. And now he's got the tie clinch. starting to land a high number of strikes here in the second round. No denying that he has taken the message from his corner and picked up the pace here in round two. Came of inches right there, boy. Wow. It was a good night if that landed. All right, single collar tie now. 
big kick. Straight right hand, no good. Big punch position. Watch him get busy with that other hand. Nice leg kick lands. Man, look at the redness now almost immediately on the right side of his body. Tries the flying knee to no avail. Oh, nice connection there with a the punch, DC. Great time to land that one. Oh, he hurt badly, Jack. Oh, big knee to the body. That'll soften him up. Well, he has stayed busy and he has stayed accurate. Nice combination. Very accurate. A lot of activity in the hands. Look phenomenal tonight. Oh, big roundhouse attempt just misses. That could have been lights out. Good stick. Whoa! He's in trouble. He's hurt bad. Oh, he might be out. Nice sneaky hit kick. Oh, he just continues to pour it on. He has been aggressive all night long with his striking. Got to be careful here to not empty the gas tank. So far, so good, though, in this round. Takedown attempt late in the round, and he gets it. And potentially a critical takedown here. All right, so you got to be careful playing on the ground with this guy. You don't want to mess around for too long. Close guard. Strong bottom work here, staying busy. And he's back to his feet. Good sign for him there. Well, missed on that one. And they separate. Oh, that's going to soften him up. Massive knee to the body. What a round. Well, I'm not sure the extent to which he has recovered, but we do see the end of the round. DC, talk us through the replay. Well, he's a tough guy. He's going to make it to the stool. He's going to survive unless you put him completely out of there. Unfortunately, he's in there with a guy that does have that ability. Fighters can't keep up this type of aggression and pace, but you don't have to worry about this guy. He hasn't really showed any signs of slowing down tonight. Liver kick. If you take those kicks, it's going to shut your body off. Kick to the body now. That one won't land. What a punch. Body kick right on the elbow. And both guys really throwing with authority. Well, we wondered earlier why there weren't as many body strikes. He's making up for lost time here. Shot to the body connects, and that bears watching. That's going to hurt this opponent. Big kick lands. Nice double leg takedown attempt there, and you gotta think that's something that's gonna give him confidence moving forward in this fight. A lot of confidence when it happens that easily. He took a shot, he got a takedown. What now will stop him from doing it over and over again? Oh man, this ground and pound is good. Probably my favorite striking realm in MMA, and he's as good as it gets. The problem is his opponent is not controlling his posture. He's allowing his opponent to get up, and when he does, he creates this space to land these beautiful ground and bomb combinations. Over and over, he landed these big body. 
body kick. Well, he is really starting to apply a lot of pressure here down the stretch. Not as much offense earlier in the fight. He is making up for lost time now. Nice punch. Oh, he caught the kick. And they separate. Nice body kick. Well done to block that powerful kick to the bottom. Oh! What a fantastic strike to throw at the exact right moment. He deserves this moment. We'll finish this fight. I mean, look at the commitment to kicking in this fight. Ooh. Whoa! News hurt. Serve him up. Go get him. He's got to go chase that finish down now. Oh, he might be out. Both of these gentlemen are putting it on the line. There's no tell in that leg kick. Oh, look at that. He left up and landed the diving punch to the head. Pretty significant welt to the left side. Big kick land. Oh! That one appeared to stop. Continues to bully his opponent here, really manhandling him on the ground. Oh, nice job to get back up again. Oh! Put him to sleep. Oh, he continues to land a high number of strikes in this round. Really hasn't let up. When it comes to his aggressiveness, certainly have to be mindful that you don't gas out, but you gotta like the output on display here. Big punch land for the middle. Able to check that kick as well. 15 seconds to go. Nice kick. Oh! And that'll do it, 15 minutes in the books. All right, so a big round for him there, DC. We'll go back and look at some of the highlights. Big knockdown for him. We'll see if he can follow it up. You could see that he was flowing. Everything was working in accordance to what he wanted it to be. And at the moment that it showed itself, the moment that the opportunity arrived, he jumped on it, got that big knockdown, and now he finds himself ahead in this fight. You ready to fight? Ready. Good. Andy lands the knee to the body now. Well, he hasn't really showed any signs of slowing down tonight. He continues to connect on a high volume of strikes here. Ooh, what a punch. Oh, beautiful strike there as he lands up top, and he does so right after catching the leg. So maybe you thought he would catch the leg and go for a takedown. Instead, he goes for the punch, and he certainly found the range on that one. Look at the turnovers in that kick. Trying to go to the body now with the kick. That one misses. Both fighters exchange in the pocket here. He's throwing every part of himself into these big leg kicks. Big liver kick lands under the elbow. Oh, big punch land. Right under the elbow, the body kick lands. Stuff 
the takedown there. How good is his takedown defense? And a nice jab there, champ. The jab was a lost art in mixed martial arts. Guys have found it, and they are fighting behind him real well. He's just being more aggressive. And oh! oh! He's got him softened up here. Man, isn't it fun to watch this dude work on the mat? He's unbelievable how fluid he is in his motion on the mat. Well, you've got to be working off of your back. He's certainly doing so here. Nice punch. Well, anytime you are in a ground fighting situation with this fighter, you're potentially playing with fire. A lot of top pressure being applied here as he works out of side control. Well, there are a few things more fun to watch in mixed martial arts than these type of transitions and scrambles on the ground. High-level grappling can really be entertaining. Well, you see all the grappling repetitions here, just beautiful movement, seamless transitions on the ground. Over and over, these guys are doing things that you see in every jiu-jitsu gym around the country. Well, one got through, that kick was blocked. Big kick land. And now they are throwing both sides with conviction. Under two minutes now to go. Oh! And just like that, the fight is over! Well, we'll take a look back at the highlights. You know we're going to find that nasty head kick somewhere in this highlight rip. Just an incredible result for him here tonight. A very nice head kick to finish the fight, but don't ignore all the work he did with his hands and give credit to the opponent. The opponent was in there every step of the way. And in order to get a fight of the night like he got tonight, both guys have to be...